Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm back with some tips for Turtle Academy. So let's get cracking. All right, friends. So in the classroom, we use FMS logo, but if you're stuck being outside the classroom, you can still do a lot of the lessons using Turtle Academy. Your code does not go with you, but I've got a way for you to get a lot of your code back. So let me show you how it works. First, friends, Turtle Academy. You can visit by typing turtleacademy.com. You can also go to hlmodtech.com, and you can click on the Virtual Learning tab to find my lessons, or you can just click Turtle Academy, and it'll launch there. Once you get there, click Login, and I recommend that you log in with Google. If you see your name up here, fantastic. Hit Profile. If it does not have the right name, you can go to Settings, and you can put your display name so that you've got what you want. If this is your very first time doing Turtle Academy, you should return to the website, go to the lessons, and real quickly complete lesson one. It'll be a refresher for FMS logo, but it'll show you what we're gonna do in the rest of this video. If you've already completed project one, then I would like you to click up on programs. Programs were created by other users and you can check them out. You can see right here, this is a sweet house project created by me. You can see all the code that I used right here and when you hit run, you get to see it draw right in front of you. This is the project we're doing in class. You can see I just kept adding more and more awesome stuff. If you want to give me some stars for it, they are always appreciated. As part of my class, what I need is for you to go back so we can search for programs and I want you to find a special one called House Kit. When you type that in, you'll see it was made by me. When you click on this, you can choose Save a Spinoff. What this does is it gives you the basic parts that we already built in class so that you've already got a door and you've got the start of an awesome house so that you don't have to rebuild everything since you're learning at home instead of in the classroom. So simply hit Save Spinoff. Yes, move to my spinoff, and boom, all of a sudden this code is yours, and then you can continue with today's lessons. Friends, now that you've got a copy, let's make it yours. Let's put house, and you can put your initials. I'm gonna put a three after mine, because I've done this more than once, and then make sure you remember, you gotta hit save. Now because we've done that, you can click on the profile, and when you hit the profile, you'll have your new house on your screen. Notice there are several pages on mine, so I have to move out and find House MDH3. Yours will most likely be on the first page. Real quickly, you'll notice that we still create words. They have to have a two, they have to have an end, and if we go all the way to the end, this is where it gets different. In Turtle Academy, we've got to type clear screen in house before we run it. Now, we had a cool thing over there called sky, so we have to add it like this. So boom, now the sky draws, or you need to go up to your word house, and if you really like how sky is turning out, well, just like before in our other projects, you can type sky up here, move back down to the bottom, and now we can delete sky in this spot. And then when you hit run, it clears the screen and the sky draws as part of the house. Let's do a quick mod to sky so that it makes it to these edges. So I'm gonna backspace on that 300 and make it a 400. I'm gonna make it go 400 high and I'm gonna change this to 800. So what I just did was add a 100 on both sides. Let's see if this works. I'm gonna hit run boom now it makes it all the way to those edges so that's how you modify the code to make things more cool remember you can visit my website and you can double check the colors so right now my sky looks like it's three let's see if it changes to 11. if we go back to turtle academy oh it was 11. so i'm going to see what it looks like with three and let's run that and I kind of like that blue sky just a little bit better. So just showing you how you can modify your projects. Now friends, if you were in my classroom, you've probably already added a lot more than this. Please don't worry about remaking your other stuff. We can mix them when you get back to school. Right now, let me show you the new stuff that I want you to build. Friends, we're just gonna return to the logo page and remember I've got these awesome starters 
there's a brand new one called the hot air balloon. Simply watch this video, friends, but the code that I'm typing here, you're going to type in Turtle Academy. The only real adjustments, friends, is when I go over here and do 2HB, you need to come back to Turtle Academy, and you need to add the code down here at the bottom. So right before house, I'm going to press enter, and I've got to type 2HB. Now, this is going to be a hot air balloon. I shorten the words. Below that, you press enter twice, and you always have to type end. Don't forget that before you start building. Now you add all the code that I added. When you're done adding the code or testing the code, make sure you type HB, and when you hit run, it will draw. Now notice it does have an error because I use something called set FC, which is the flood color in FMS logo. In Turtle Academy, when you set PC, it sets the paint color for everything. So instead of set FC, when we're using Turtle Academy, we always use set PC. So I'll go back and real quickly fix mine. Friends, I do want to warn you, don't just try and copy my code. You'll really want to follow the video so that you learn how to move it around. Just remember that you type it in HB, you run HB after house, and you'll be able to keep seeing your changes. Let me try and run this again. This time my colors showed up, and you can see I've got an adorable little hot air balloon. Now there are things you'll have to mod. You'll notice that my 1020 doesn't fit real well, so I'm gonna change that ellipse to 1030, and let's run it again. That's a little better. I'm gonna try an ellipse of 1035 and see if that becomes even more epic. And that, my friends, is what I like. I think instead of 10, I'm going to try 20 and run it one more time. Bam. That's what I was aiming for. So my friends, the moral of the story is make sure that when you're doing these, you just adjust to how they work in Turtle Academy and then you keep getting through them one at a time having fun and learning a little bit of coding at a time. When you're finished, don't forget every day you do need to hit save. The beauty of this is it does save to the cloud and you can use it at school the next day. The trick is you do need to always remember to hit save. Friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.